You ready? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I'm standing. <laughs> so this is us. Two person in a Hobie Outback. There's our boy, Barrett Fine over there fishing. It doesn't even seem too squatty in the stern. No, it does not. Now I am standing in water back here. Like I said, this is 250 pounds in the back of this boat. And Ernie's 240, so we got 500 pounds in this thing. Because I think Ernie lied. He's probably 250. So it's floating. And it's not too unstable, like I said. And I'm standing. So see, here we are standing in the Hobie Outback. <laughs> I thought we were going over. But, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed with this thing. It's pretty... I like it. Stability's pretty easy. We still maintain them pretty good speed. Whoa! Oh, grab my shoulder, not my greasy head. <laughs> Alright. Not my greasy, sweaty head, you'll fall. Alright. What it is is we're sinking the back, Ernie. Oh yeah. Let me get some moving, guys. I'm in like ankle deep water back here now. Oh, I stopped pedaling. <laughs> yeah. So the key is not don't stop pedaling. You need momentum. All all Outbacks pre-order from Sunjammers will come with a chauffeur. So that's it. You know, obviously don't put 250 pounds in the back of the Outback. But, um, I mean, if you put a, a ice chest back here or a fish box, you're going to be totally fine. All right, now let's see if he can let, let me. Oh, you're going to go reverse. There you go. Doc's never Easy. seemed so far away. Easy. Go back oh. Oh, and I sat on the cleat. So you can see all that water that's in the back, but look. Look at all that water is just draining right out the scuppers like it's supposed to. In fact, it's draining so well it was creating a siphon. Sounds like somebody flushed a toilet. So anyway, this is the 2019 Hobie Mirage Outback, and we just put 500 pounds in it and did some circles, and we lived. So I think Hobie solved all of their um, flotation issues in the back end with this thing.